We are doing September's beauty boxes and it has not been a year. Um, I'm just wearing extensions from a video I just recorded. I've never worn extensions before and I kind of like it. But anyways, so we are doing September's beauty boxes. I only do three. I have Allure, um, Ice Cream Beauty, and the Box of Charm by Ipsy. And if you don't already know, I do list the prices of the subscriptions as well as the individual priced items. Allure is the only one that doesn't have all full size and those ones, um, I let you know whether they're full size or not. I don't calculate the difference in the price, but I do let you know the full size price. Here's the Allure box. This is the inside of the Allure box. Nothing super exciting, but yeah. Go ahead and look at it. There is always a little brochure with the items on the inside and it lists like the price and the little details about it. Okay, so the first thing out of the box is this right here. This is full size. This is uh, retails for $35. It's nude stick newbies matte all over face blush color and this is in cherry blossom babe and you can see the name right there so this is definitely something i'm going to use so we're going to look at it that is the color right there this is the color swatched and I'm going to take a brush and kind of um, blend, blend it out so we can see what it, well no we're not going to use that brush because I almost forgot this has a brush so let's see how it looks with this brush here. So it blends out really good, it's a nice color, nice brush, I think I'm going to like that. I think that's really pretty and I think it goes great with my skin tone. Okay, so the next thing we got here is Ren Clean Skin Care. This retails for $51 and it is full, full size. I'm surprised that's full size, but yeah, $51. This is what the little pump looks like. I do think that's cute. It is cute, but for $51, I would expect at least a glass tube, but it's okay. It um, says please recycle, so maybe they are protecting the environment. Okay, so the next thing we got here is Beauty for Certain. This is high pigmented gloss in diamond, and this retails for thirty or twenty-two dollars. For me, it just looks like a clear. I guess there is some sparkle in it. Let's open it and see, because I I collect all the clear glosses. Okay, so there's a little sparkle to it. I don't know if it's gonna pick on up on camera. But yeah, see, there's a little sparkle to it. It looks more like just shine, but I think it's just gonna give it more of a wet look because it's very, very small. Okay, the next thing we got is also full size. This is Clear Midnight Atler Lip Pencil in Stella. And this retails for $18. Uh, I don't really use lip liner and I'm not sure how I feel about it. I think, I think I'm going to pass this on. I'm, I'm going to put it in my giveaway bin. Right, the next thing we got here is Clean It Zero right here. Now this is sample size. Uh, full size is 100 milliliter. This is 7 milliliter. Full size is $22. Uh, this is a cal calming cleansing cream. I usually use stuff like this to loosen up my makeup at the end of the day and wipe it off and it looks pretty good or works pretty good. Okay, so the next thing we got is Red Flower Cleansing Wash. So do not confuse this with face wash. This is actually a hair wash. Uh, the full size is 300 milliliter, this is 40 milliliter, and the full size retails for $38. So it's still relatively pricey, but I, I like the, the little bottle here. Okay, the last thing in the Allure box is some soap from Dove. This is coconut milk and sugar in Scent Litchi. And let me tell you, this smell is incredible. Uh, it, is, it says it's a cleansing bar, not to be confused with a moisturizing bar. 
um, and this retails for $5.99, but it, like I said, it smells stinking amazing. All right, we are moving on to Ice Cream Beauty. The, they stick to like more of the um, independent beauty brands, which I adore. This is what the inside of the box looks like, and they do also provide a card with all the items and the prices. The first thing we got here is Moon Slice Beauty. Excuse me. This is the new Moon palette, and it retails for thirty dollars. Let's see what this palette looks like. This is what it looks like. This is not really unique to the palettes I have, so I'm going to put it in my bin for future giveaways and I will not be swatching it, but these are incredibly beautiful. I was tempted to keep it, uh, but again, I try not to keep too many palettes because I only go through them so fast. Okay, so we got another gloss. This is Allure by Illuminati. This is, this retails for $20 and of course I like my glosses, so let's see what this gloss looks like. Okay, so that's the gloss on camera and it says it has kind of a gold shine to it. I can't really tell. Um, it's not as moisturizing as the other one, but it still feels really nice. This one's a little bit more sticky, but it does feel nice. Okay, so this is from Ace Beauty. Um, this is Perfect Pound Liquid Lipstick. And this retails for $18. So it says ambition. I'm not sure what I'm getting. Oh, this looks fancy. Look at that. That's pretty. This is a color I would wear, so I'm going to go ahead and swatch it. But like, still, let's give it another moment because this is really pretty and fancy looking. Okay, so this is the color. It's kind of a burnt rust pumpkin-y brick color, if that makes sense. But yeah, that's what it looks like. And I think if it's... You know, I think you can do a lot with this color. Um, it's not a color I normally wear, but I do like it, and I think it'll go with a lot of eyeshadow colors I have. Okay, so the next thing we have is a multi-chrome palette by Delancey. That's what it looks like right here, and this retails for $22. I actually really like their duochrome, so I'm kind of excited to see what this looks like. Okay, so that is the colors. I'm I'm already telling you, I'm gonna keep this because I, like I said, I really like their duochromes. I'm gonna swatch those so we can see what those look like. So this is what they look like. I'm a little bit surprised about this one because I wasn't expecting to see the gold in it, but it's like one angle, it's almost a silver. Another angle, it's more of a gold. I like that. Those are really pretty shadows and I'm definitely going to be playing with them very soon. Okay, the last thing we got here is ZC right here and this is champagne gold twist eyeliner and it comes with a sharpener and it retails for $24 I really like ZC products I generally did not get a lot of their products before getting this box and I really like it because I have a lot of invent it really just creative colors and stuff in in their um, makeup line and I really enjoy using it Okay, so I don't see the sharpener, but this is the pencil looks like. We're going to open both ends and see. It's probably this end. Yeah, okay, so that's the sharpener right there. And you take it, you take it on this end and sharpen it like that. But we're not going to do that. We're going to see what this looks like on my skin. Okay, you can see right there. I actually really like this because it kind of has like a, a sparkle, like a glitter sparkle to it. And it's not, it's not like a yellow gold like most tend to be. This is, you know, a, a nice glittery gold and I think it's really pretty. All right, this is my BoxyCharm by Ipsy. And I have feelings about that, but y'all know that. So we're not gonna, we're not gonna discuss that. Um, can't really show you too much here without giving everything away, but that's the inside of the box. Now the pamphlet that they give me don't list the prices or anything. I have to go online to find that. So when I edit the video, I will edit in the pricing, but I'm not gonna be mentioning it as I open them. 
All right, the first thing we got here is Cat Berkey. This is Rose Hip Intense Recovery Eye Serum. This is what the bottle looks like, and I do like it. It is glass, or at least it feels like glass. But that is what it looks like. I do use my eye serums and creams like crazy, so I will never say no to a new one. The next thing we got here is cream eyeshadow. This is Nira from YC Collection. I'm gonna pass on this because at no matter how many times I use eye creams and eyeshadow, liquid eyeshadows and stuff, they never turn out well for me. I really don't understand why, but they don't. So I am going to pass this along. See, that's what the tube looks like, so I still don't know the color. Um, I don't see anything on there. It says it's in shade Kindness. Okay, so the next thing we got here is Ren Skin Clean Skin Care. This is, it says Hydrate Moisturize Replenish Cream. That is what it looks like right here. Let's see what the bottle looks like. That is the bottle. I do like this bottle. I think it's very nice. Next thing I got here is Eloise Flawless Loose Setting Powder. And I'm thrilled about this because I was running low on setting powder and it came just in time. This is what it looks like. A nice big old square. It says Vanilla Loose Setting Powder. So I'm assuming it's going to smell like vanilla. I still have some setting powder so I'm not opening it yet. I don't like to open things until I'm ready to use uh, just to keep it in good condition longer. Okay, so the last thing is Clean Formance. This is from Dr. Barber and this is a Renewal Night Mask. So that's what it looks like. Um, I'm about to break these out because I use night mask religiously in the winter time because my skin is incredibly dry in the winter time. So I'm going to be getting a lot of use out of that. Um, that is it of my beauty boxes for this month. Let me know your thoughts down below, uh, what you think of these products. That is it. If you like this video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. If you like more content like this, please don't forget to subscribe. Otherwise, I will see you in my next video.